Hi everybody, my name is Sean O'Kane with Chip Estimate TV, your IP resource for your next chip design in the world of the EDA industry. We're here at DVCon 2011 and today is System C Day. My guest is Shishpal Ruat, Ruat excuse me, um, the Director of Business Enabling Programs with Intel and you're the Chair of Accelera as well. That's right. It's a beautiful thing because Accelera just recently announced the approval of the universal uh, verification methodology known as UVM st as a standard. That's right. Um, and that standard is working to improve uh, uh, design and verification efficiencies. Okay, so that's great. So why is this an important standard? Well, universal verification methodology is something that Excel has worked on for a long time. And it is really to help people be able to use their verification IP interchangeably. Mm -hmm. And so uh, there are, you know, within a given design team, there are people who have developed their verification IP with uh, different intent in mind and different focus. So this allows people to come together mm -hmm. and have a uniform interchange mechanism. Then the, the tool providers can actually figure out a way to service the, the customer in a uniform way. And mm -hmm. that basically brings more efficiency, both for the design team and also for the tool providers. So I think it's a win-win situation for both. How, how was it developed originally? Uh, the basis for UVM came about by uh, adopting, I think, Cadence's standard, OVM, OVM. and then adding on uh, some stuff from VMM and mm -hmm. some other uh, materials that people thought was necessary for UVM to go forward. So they uh, took all this material from a variety of places and that was good that the industry was able to donate different pieces to make it happen. Over a hundred people worked on the standard and uh, just concluded uh, bringing it to life and th the board was happy to, to approve the standard when it all came together. Okay, yeah, and so talk a little bit about some, a few of the benefits of the UVM standard. Just a few of, of the benefits, for example, for small companies, how, how does that how would it uh, benefit smaller companies? I think the smaller companies will benefit by by being able to use the IP interchangeably. They won't have to spend enormous amounts of design effort to to reinvent their IPs and make it suitable for working, say, in mm -hmm. a cadence environment or a mm -hmm. mentor environment or a synopsis environment. Mm -hmm. So the, the the choice of tools would not be as relevant. But the choice that would really be relevant is how well is their methodology supported mm -hmm. by the various suppliers out there. So if somebody does a great job on memory, mm -hmm. they'll probably use that one for the memory intensive stuff, jobs. If somebody does a really great job on handling registers and mm -hmm. stuff like that, then they, they're going to go and use uh, uh, a, a supplier who can actually uh, make, their, uh, make their environment run very efficiently. So, so mm -hmm. adoption is coming along. Yes. Uh, well, adoption will start we'll now. Now. As, uh, uh, that's as, why we're here. As people will uh, will start working their, uh, building their IPs U in a UVM 1.8 a compliant way, and that will basically start the whole thing. Mm -hmm. And I expect that uh, you know, all the major suppliers are supporting the standard because it is, after all, an evolution of something that already existed. Mm -hmm. So they'll be able to move forward and, and take it to the next step. Share with our audience what is next on the roadmap for Accelera. So Accelera is in the business of developing a lot of system level standards. And recently we merged with, with uh, Spirit Organization. Mm -hmm. And so we are taking the next step with all the uh, mechanisms that are in place for uh, IP interchange, which is uh, IP exact, and system RDL, mm -hmm. and IP tagging. So those are some of the areas that we'll be working on next and, and trying to bring new standards to the community. Well, thank you very much for taking the time to, to join us today. Thank you very much. All right. It's a pleasure well, talking to you. Well, thank you. Shishpal Rawat, uh, Director of uh, uh, Engineering Enabling Programs with Intel, and he's the chair of Accelera. She's here today and, of course, running the show. <laughs> there's uh, a lot of other people running well, the show. Well, there's really. Yeah, <laughs> so we uh, really appreciate you being here. Uh, my name is Sean O'Kane. We're going to see you next time on Chip Estimate TV. Thanks. Thank you. All right.